At How It's Made, we pride ourselves in showing you the nuts and bolts of how everyday items are made. So it's about time we visited a real nuts and bolts operation. We sure couldn't do without these tiny but essential pieces of hardware. If only they weren't so darn easy to lose. Nuts and bolts are made from what's called steel wire rod. After spending up to 30 hours in a furnace to soften it enough to be worked, the wire rod goes into a bath of sulfuric acid to remove any rust particles. It's rinsed in water, then coated with phosphate, a chemical compound. This prevents the steel from rusting before the bolt forming begins and lubricates the steel to make forming easier. They form the bolts by cold forging, shaping the steel at room temperature by forcing it through various dies at high pressure. The forming machine first straightens the wire rod, then cuts it into pieces slightly longer than the bolt length. The extra will become the bolt head. Each piece goes through a die that makes it perfectly round, then through a series of dies that progressively shape the head of the bolt on one end. The machine heads up to 300 bolts per minute. Here's what the heading stages look like in slow motion.